Uh, so in this video we're going to talk about types of data and we're going to create a little flow chart uh, to show all of the different types of data and how they're sort of interconnected. Uh, let's go. So the first type of data we've got is quantitative. Now quantitative, like quantity, quantitative quantity, like a number. So any kind of data that you can collect which is number data, like someone's age or their height or their weight, that's quantitative data, number data. Let's compare it to qualitative data. So quality, like the quality that something has. So for instance, black hair, brown hair, red hair, blonde hair. This isn't number data, this is qualitative data, quality data. So uh, another word that you might want to use for this is categorical. Sometimes people don't use qualitative, they use the word categorical, categories. Black hair, brown hair, blonde hair. So there are two major types of data, number data and categorical data. But we can split those data types into different uh, data types as well. So I'm going to split up our quantitative data. So inside of our quantitative data, we can split that into two groups, discrete or continuous data. So let's talk about discrete data first. Discrete is uh, exact values. So um, I'll just write that. So for instance, the grade you are in in school, you're in grade 1 or 2 or 3 or 4, 11, 12, those are discrete values. You're never in grade 1.1 or 1.2. Uh, now another example of a discrete value, shoe size. Okay, so you're either 9 or 9.5 or 10. You're not 9.25786. These are discrete values. They can only be certain things. Now, if we compare that to continuous, continuous can take absolutely any value. So let's think about uh, a person's weight or height. Now, you can have an infinity of different weights or heights for, an for a person. So I know this might blow your mind a little bit, but you've been every single height from birth up until what you are right now. You were one meter tall at some point, and then you were 1.0000000001, and then you were 1.0000002, all the way up to whatever height you are currently. Crazily, you've actually been an infinite number of heights all the way up to it. Same with your weight. You might think you're about 75 kilos, but actually you're probably 75.27659862234. So continuous can take absolutely any value, whereas discrete are only exact values. Now those exact values can be 7 or 7.5 or 7 and 3 quarters, but they can only be those discrete values. Continuous can be anything at all. In the same way that we've split up our quantitative data, we can split up our qualitative data as well. So we've got categorical data, but we've got two distinct groups of categorical data. All right, so the two discrete groups we have are nominal and ordinal. Uh, now, nominal categorical data is probably what you think about when you think about categorical data. It means that it has no order. So uh, a red car, a blue car, a black car, a white car, they're just categories. They have no order to them at all. Now, if that means that nominal has no order, then ordinal means that you have an order. Now, you're thinking, what, what sort of qualitative or categorical data would have an order? Well, uh, let's think about, like, if you're in the army. You're a private, and then you're a... Uh, Lance Corporal, and then you're a Corporal, and then you're a Sergeant, and then you're a Staff Sergeant. This is an order. It might not be numerical data, but it definitely has a distinct order to it. Uh, and when you get your grades at the end of the semester, you might get a VLA, an LA, a Sound, a HA, or a VHA. Now again, these are categories, but they're also ordinal categories. They're categories with an order. Okay, so this is data, quantitative or qualitative, numbers or categorical, discrete or continuous, so the numbers can either be exact values or continuous, an infinite number of values, 
qualitative, nominal, either no order, black hair, brown hair, red hair, cars, red, yellow, green, blue, or ordinal, some sort of categories, but they're in an order. Types of data.